game that could have gone either way, especially in that last 15, 20 minutes. What do you think of it? Tough game. They're always a tough team to play against. Um, they're very well drilled. They know what they're doing. Solid defence. That's why they're one of the best defensive records in the league. Um, you know, we went out of the game plan as well. Had enough chances for me to win the game. You know, the boys kept going all the way till the end, like they always do. Um, but it's one of them days where when they defend like they do, we're just not going to go in the net. How do you make that penalty save? Is there a lot of psychology involved, or are you just guessing away? And um, yeah, we'll leave it as guessing. <laughs> we're not going to give too much away on that one. Okay. Um, and on that double save, uh, just towards the end there, are you, what's the thought process like when you're making that? Is it just pure reaction? It's you, you just have to throw yourself. There's, there's nothing you can do, there's no skill involved. It's just literally throw yourself as, like, as big as you can, get as close to the player as you can, give them no way around you or over you. Um, and it's, yeah, you do, it's part of the job and sometimes you have to make saves like that and it's, it's not very nice but you know, when you do make the saves it, uh, it does feel better and it makes it <laughs> sting slightly less. How much confidence does having a game that good give you? Always, you know, but the main confidence comes from playing with these boys. Um, you know, all round we trust each other, we know what each other's doing, we know each other's jobs. Um, you know, so it just makes it an all round easy job. We back each other every step of the way. Um, and that's why, you know, that's why we're the team we are and, and doing as well as we are this season. And then playing against a side who sits relatively deep and you may not have much to do for a long period of the game, what's it like keeping concentration? It's just communication. You can keep yourself switched on by just talking to your back four, organising, staying alive to the game. Because the more you're talking, the more that they're listening to you, they're staying switched on, it keeps you switched on if you're constantly passing on information. So, yeah. And then lastly, on the ball, how important is having that relationship with that back three? Oh, massive. We work on it every day. Um, you know, everyone's moving, everyone's not standing still. And we kind of all know where each other are going to be and we trust each other. And that's, like I say, that all comes from the confidence that we have in each other. Laurie, thank you. It's brilliant. No worries, man. Just